Hey, my name is Christine Boyer, and I help fitness fans and fitness pros create and develop a schedule of activity in their normal day to be able to create a full-time income in fitness, something they're passionate about, something you're passionate about. What I wanted to really help and share with you today is a big question out there. When you are involved in building your business, you're going to start to collect customers. Some customers will be reoccurring buying customers. Some of them might you know, buy every new product that comes out the gate. And then you're also going to have those customers that buy on monthly shipment. So the product line, of course, that I'm going to be talking about is Shakeology. So for those of you who are Team Beachbody coaches, many people, of course, have customers who are on Shakeology Home Direct, an auto shipment that's shipped out every 30 days monthly to that customer. So there comes that big question for coaches in terms of do you encourage that customer to stop being a customer, save 25% on their Shakeology to sign up as a coach member so they at least can get their Shakeology cheaper. So there's kind of a couple different ways you want to think about this. So I'm going to kind of give it all to you and then you just make the best decision, whatever you feel is best for your own business. So thinking about it this way, me, okay. If I can help someone save money somewhere or another, I'm totally going to do it. So I personally don't care to miss the $32 commissions that I will get off of a customer buying auto shipment on Shakeology every month. I honestly would prefer that person make that choice to stay on Shakeology longer, commit it to themselves because they're getting it cheaper. So for me, I would encourage my customers to actually stop being a customer buying Shakeology at full price and to sign up as a coach membership so that they can save 25% on their Shakeology and um, me, not with that $32 commission, but they of course are saving that money themselves per month. Personally for me, I would encourage that because again, if, if I can help someone get something that they love that gives them amazing results and keeps them super duper healthy, I am totally okay with not making commission on that. Honestly, I don't care about that commission. I prefer people to live a healthier life, one way or another. So I would do it. Now, here's where it comes down into another side of things. I've learned in the course of the time of me being a coach within the network that many people, especially customers who are on auto shipment, and then you sign them up as a coach discount uh, rep, basically. They're not building the business. They're basically just using this like a Costco membership. They're saving 25% on anything that they want. Typically, this is the average of what happens. So a customer signs up to be a coach membership so that they can save on their Shakeology. Usually it's around a three to six month turnaround time before that person either cancels or cancels the home direct. Usually around a six month time frame. And reason mostly is because a customer just in for the membership to get a discount they are not committed into the lifestyle, into the community, into uh, staying connected to you know the company deeper. They're basically just getting their product delivered to their house cheaper every month. What tends to happen is they start to stockpile their Shakeology because they don't drink it consistently because there's no one really kind of you know side by side with them. They're not vested into the company. They're just getting a product delivered to their house cheaper every month. So think about any other product that you have on auto ship coming to your house that you have no ties or connection into the company. I mean, even if it comes down to an auto shipment that you have on Amazon, like getting your dog food shipped to your house monthly on Amazon, I mean, you have no vested interest in Amazon, but if you start to stockpile some of that dog food, you're just going to cancel that dog food order. That's typically what will happen. So the chance or the, the risk, should I say, that if you as a coach are trying to decide to switch your customer over to being a coach so that you can then you know, have that volume to pay you in team volume, which of course where the money is at, but uh, you are then taking that risk of that customer canceling their Shakeology because they stockpiled because they're not drinking it consistently or canceling altogether. So that's a risk that you take. You know, it might happen still them being a customer, they can still stockpile their Shakeology and then still cancel it. So it's a matter of, you know, what, what do you prefer? It's kind of like this decision. You decide what you would do with that. Now, for instance, if you're a brand new coach really starting to try to build your business 
and you need to get to Emerald and you have a customer that's buying and you prefer them to save and you need a coach active on product to be able to move up in rank, then it's a great decision to go ahead and do that. But the, again, the other side you have to think about is if you fill your business up with product discount coaches, you're building a business that's not going to really pay you much. And the reason is because rank doesn't mean money. So for instance, many people think that moving up to diamond rank means that you're making tons of money. No, it all comes down to volume. Diamond only means you have 12 people in your business with you. And if you put in all your, like, so you personally need four and four people on each side. And out of these four, you know, one of them has to have two people on their business and one has to have two people on their business, whatever the case may be. But say, for instance, you just put these three people are product discount coaches. You're only making the point volume on that purchase that that person's making every four weeks. When you're building a business where these people are not building business, they're just on Shakeology, 90 points every four weeks, you're not going to make much team cycle bonus. You're, you're really going to be cutting yourself a loss because you're not building a level of team of people who want to get out there and help more people. So this is a decision on your part. Do you take the loss of the, the $32 commission to save someone money so that they can stay stronger in Shakeology? Personally, I would do it. I don't care about the $32 commission. I prefer about people living a healthy lifestyle, period. Um, but then the other side of it all is you're going to take that risk that that person may, you know, cancel that shipment. How can you avoid that? I'm going to give you a quick little tip here. So when you get your customers on auto shipment, do the best you can with getting them pulled into this lifestyle, drinking more of the Kool-Aid, more accountable. Include them in any Facebook groups that you have. Invite them always to be a part of what you have going on. Don't sell them on more things. You don't always need to sell your customers on new products. Just be a person that helps your customers. Invite them to be a part of what you have going on with no obligation. Send them newsletter tips. Be a presence with them. Find them on Facebook. Find them on Instagram. Find them and start to develop a relationship and start trying to help them be stronger to their goals and to be a part of the party. That's what we are doing. We are creating a lifestyle and a party together. And the more people that we invite to the party, the funner the party is, right? So hopefully this gives you some clarity. It's a matter of personal choice and decision, but those are some things to think about. Thanks so much. Make sure that you go and follow me on Facebook. Come on, that would be the smartest thing for you to do. Go to facebook.com slash Coach Dwyer. Thanks so much. Bye.